guys, it's Destiny and Tim doing a back to school clothing haul and this is part one. I will have like a part two sometime soon, probably like two weeks because I'm going to the outlets and probably going to the mall again or something and doing online shopping because I always do online shopping. But I ordered from oasap.com, threadup.com, and Rose wholesale.com and then I went to the mall yesterday and I went to H&M Forever 21 and PacSun. I'm going to start with OASAP because it just came in today and I'm like excited about it. The thing I got to was this black cami tank top and it's just lace and it has like a ruffle on it but it just looks like this and I haven't tried any of this stuff on because I just got it today but it's a spaghetti strap tank top and you can adjust the straps which I really love. It's really cute and I thought um the part where it has like this overlay wasn't sheer but it still is so yeah that's what it looks like I got this shirt which is kind of similar but it has like white straps and it has this print on it so it's maroon and white and it smells really weird like it's kind of <coughs> like I don't know it smells really really bad so I have to wash it before I wear it but it again has like the little layered thing and I think it's really cute I thought it would be cute with like jeans or maybe like black jeans or something. Got this shirt, which is also kind of similar. It also has like the layered ruffle thing, but this one's white with some floral. I think the back is super duper cute. I love like intricate backs and it's just like two straps that cross and I don't know, I think it's really cute. Got this t-shirt, which is just a white t-shirt with little watermelons all over it because I think watermelons are really cute and I like shirts like this because they're really easy to like throw on so I would probably just like roll the sleeves up and tie the bottom in a knot and wear it with like some jean shorts and you would be good to go and it's still like cute but it's really casual so yeah and it's really like soft and comfy so sweater I thought it was like a hoodie like a crew neck kind of thing but it's more just like a sweater so it's just a black sweater with a little cat face on it and I love cats the last thing from OASAP is this skirt and I bought shorts in this pattern from she inside but they were too big a denim material skater skirt circle skirt thing whatever you want to call it and I hope it fits because I do have a pretty small waist things I got from ThreadUp. What Plato's Closet is, it's pretty much that but online. Like you can send in um, boxes of clothes and they will go through them and sell the ones that they like and they give you up to 80% of its selling price which is really high and that's good. So yeah and you get 40% off your first order which is amazing because the prices are low anyway. The thing I got was this shirt and my sister actually has this in navy blue with the same like pink and she got it at TJ Maxx for $15. But hers, she got it in a small or extra small, and it shrunk a lot in the wash. It's in a medium, but I figured since hers shrunk, this one would probably shrunk too. And it does, it looks like a size small, like it doesn't look like a medium, so I'm assuming it did shrink. And that's why the person like sold it. But it's just a tank top, it's white, and it's kind of like textured, it's really cute. And then it just kind of has like a little ruffle at the bottom with some pink embroidery. I got two dresses, so this one's kind of like a beach dress. It's originally from ASOS, and it's really cute. It's just black, like, lace crochet, and it is sheer, so it would be really cute over a bathing suit going to the beach. That's probably where I'll wear it, or you could wear, like, a slip under it. It's like a heart design at one part of it, and I don't know. I think it's really pretty, and... Dress, which is originally from American Eagle, orange and kind of like blue zips on the side. It does have some like fraying there, but you can't really tell when it's on. And the back just looks like this. It's really pretty. It crosses like that. I really like it. And it's just kind of a tribal print and it has pockets, which is amazing because I love pockets because I don't carry purses ever. So pockets are like my lifesaver because that's where I hold like all my stuff. long sleeve shirt which I thought would be really nice for back to school it's just a maroon colored and it's by the brand soprano I don't really know what that is I don't know where they sell that but it's just like this it's really soft and like cozy it's long sleeve and then on the sides it just has this lace design like crochet I think it's really pretty 
originally from Gap Kids, and I don't know, I just thought it was cute online, I don't know, I tried it on and I didn't really like it, but I was gonna like cut off the strap because I just wanted it to be one shoulder, but the ruffle kind of fits weird. I got to this Vans hoodie and I just thought it would be nice for like cozy nights. Um, I probably won't wear it to like school or anything, but it's just like this. It has stripes on it and stuff and it's a hood obviously. It's like a pretty thin hoodie so it would be good for like summer nights, but yeah, it's just like that. Pretty simple. Not really my style, but something about me just wanted it. is from J. Crew, which is usually expensive, size medium, so it's pretty like oversized, but I would like my sweaters like that, so it's just mint with some black stripes, and it looks like that, really like big, but cozy, and it's a really thick knit, so it'll be good for those really cold summer days, I mean, <laughs> those really cold winter days. This sweater from Abercrombie and it's a size medium. This one's like gigantic. It looks like a grandpa sweater, but I just thought it would be really cozy to like play in the snow in or something because I don't know, that's just what I envisioned. I just imagined like a snow day, but it's so thick. It's like really, really heavy and I don't know. I like the color of it. I probably won't wear it to like school or anything, but I like it for some reason. It looks like you would find it at Goodwill. These pair of shoes I got, they're Steve Madden, kind of like textured and they're cheetah print. They're really like out there obviously. I don't know when I'm going to wear them. Edge booty thing and then they just kind of like tie up. Thought they would look good with like a black dress or something. They're really like fun and stuff so I figured I would get them. And they're Steve Madden and they were like $20 so that's a really good price because they're usually like 100 But yeah, that's them. And then with the jeans, I got three pairs from Abercrombie. This first pair is capris, and they're just like distressed. And they're like stretchy, like jeggings kind of. And then they have some distressing on the pocket. And I don't have any Abercrombie jeans, so I figured I would try some out. Then I got to this pair, which are like really dark and really plain, but they just look like this, and they're good for like everyday use. I haven't tried these on, so I hope they fit, but the pocket is just simple like that, and I don't know, I like them. Got to this pair, which is jeggings, and they're like super stretchy, as you can tell, they're like, they're not even like jean material at all, but yeah, they're like super duper stretchy, and they look like this and I hope they don't look like pajama jeans or something on because that's what they feel like. American Eagle and they are jeggings, just a plain dark wash jegging. Well, they're kind of like medium wash actually, but yeah, they just look like that. They're kind of like faded on the knees. I don't know if that's how they came or they're just like worn, but I think it looks cool. And then the pockets are just like dark stitching like that. BDG cigarette high-rise jeans which they sell at Urban Outfitters for like $50 and I'm pretty sure these were like under 15 but they're just mint green high-waisted jeans and they are just skinny jeans like that. But the last thing I got from ThreadUp are a pair of Hollister jeans and they're just plain light wash jeans and they look kind of like big at the bottoms like I don't know Hollister jeans like the actual jeans not the jeggings are kind of like loose fit my thighs and like my butt and my waist good and everything but then like the knee down just looks kind of like weird and like saggy Then at rosewholesale.com, I just got four things. I got two of these shorts. I don't have the other ones with me right now, but they are the same thing in plain black, and I really like them. I've worn them, like, three times already, and they were really cheap, so they just look like this. The green ones are kind of, like, metallic-y, but they're just, like, an army green color. A lot of the stuff I order online is too loose for me, actually, because I don't, like, measure myself right or something, because I always read the size charts, 
but then I order like what size they tell me to get and it's always too big so I guess I just need to like get someone to measure me because I don't know my measurements obviously but these fit white shorts which are just kind of like a cotton material and then they have like this crochet at the bottom and I've seen a lot of pictures of these on Instagram and I don't know they look kind of weird on I wore them the other day and they are kind of see-through so you got to wear like nude underwear with them or you can see and then the last thing I got at Rose wholesale was this dress and it's just kind of like a t-shirt material dress it's really like comfy and just like easy to throw on like casual casual <laughs> But I have this same dress in a different color that I got from Banggood, and I really like the style of the dress. It's really, like, comfy, and, um, it just looks like this. It's a tank dress, and it looks really shapeless, but it has these strings that you tie and tighten, and you can make it, like, a skater dress if you want. So I'm going to start with Forever 21 because that's the first place I went. This scarf and it was like a style deal, back to school deal thing and it was only $6. Dollars, dollars. But it's just black and white stripes and it's an infinity scarf and I like it because it's not like thin, like it's like a nice chunky infinity scarf because that's how I like them. Then I got sweatpants. Yeah, I know what has gotten into me. I don't know. But they're just gray and gray. I'm weird. Okay. They're gray and then they have like a black tie and they have pockets. Again, I love pockets. And they get like skinnier at the bottom but not like extremely skinny. And we're on sale for 13 so that's really not bad. And I just thought they would be nice for like lounging and they're kind of more like acceptable sweatpants. H&M little tank top and it's just gray and it's like the salt and pepper design it's, yeah I like it and it is an extra small and it was $9.95 but they do run like really really large because if this is an extra small then I don't know what an extra large would be shorts that look like pajama shorts but I don't think they are I'm not I'm going to wear them out of the house I don't care but they're just like mint and they're like chiffon like silky kind of material and they just have like a lace trim like that but they were $12.95 to this dress which was $14.95 and I just thought it was so like delicate and like pretty and like simple but I don't know I just liked it for some reason so it's just like mint and it is like sheer but you can wear like a nude bandeau and you're probably good like I don't know it's not like you can see right through it so yeah it's like that and then you have a little cutout on the side with some lace and I really like it it has zips in the back like that and then it just kind of flares out Pack Sun, so their clearance or sale stuff, I guess, was buy two, get three free. The two things I paid for were these, so I got to these little white shorts, and they're just kind of like booty shorts. They're not like that short, like my butt cheeks don't hang out of them, but they're just like this, and they were originally $32.95, but I only paid $27, so yeah, I got to these, and they're like stretchy and nice, and I don't have any like good fitting white shorts. This shirt, which is the other thing I paid for, and it was originally like $25, but it was down to $22, so I ended up paying like a total of $50 for all five of these things, but it's just really pretty tank top, and I don't know, I really like it. It's just black and white tribal print, it's like chiffon, and then the straps are hot pink, I thought it would look really good with like a tan, like on the boardwalk or something. So that's probably where I'll wear it, but it just has like a strappy caged back and then a little ruffle thing of the tribal print. This shirt, which is going to be hard, hard to show, but I'll show you in like the clip. So this was on sale for $17.99, but I got it for free. A fall like tribal print, but it's like a summertime shirt. But it just has this little like ruffle with like a little lace trim. It's not even lace, it's like frayedness, like kind of a rope thing. But these two straps tie into a bow at the top of your back and then it shows a little bit of skin. 
got this sweater, which was on sale for 20 but I also got it for free. Really light sweater. I thought it would be cute with those white shorts on, like, a summer day, like, I don't know. But it's purple, and it's, like, a light knit. It's really thin. And then I couldn't find anything else that I liked in the PacSun sale rack, but my mom liked this, so I just decided I would get it for her. It's um, just a white, like, t-shirt. I tried it on in my size, but it looked weird on me. So it's just like this. It has, like, drapey sleeves, and it's really soft, and then it has, like, lace on the side, and... Yeah, my mom looks really cute in it, but I didn't look cute in it. So yeah, I'm a great daughter who treats her mother. But yeah, that is my haul. I also got a penny board. It's um, pastel fade. It's like pink, yellow, and blue. I got my penny board in the mail yesterday, but I haven't got to ride it much because I was kind of sick yesterday because on the day before yesterday, I had a 103.8 degree fever, which is pretty high, obviously. And then I threw up twice and I was like shaking kind of and like I couldn't really breathe still don't know what's like what happened to me but I'm fine now so yeah just now I'm kind of like sick I have like a sore throat and like my nose is kind of runny but I don't know what happened to me because it came like out of nowhere too and I just got like really hot but yeah so that is my haul and I hope you guys liked this thank you guys for watching and have a good day bye